Hello everyone, this is Tyler. I was working on this spa resort vision on Minecraft. So I'm going to be presenting that here to you. And we're going to get right into it. So here we are at the front entrance. This is the actual spa. See that center fountain there? And a hot tub jacuzzi there uh, for everyone to use whenever they please. But the real highlight of this building has to be the... Uh, the rooms for the massage and treatments. This is the red room right here. Has its own private jacuzzi designed for a couple. Also a seated area there. We had to use some stairs and planks and fencing for all of you Minecraft fans out there. You've discovered that you have to do that sort of thing. This is the blue room. Has its own private fountain in here or garden area. I really like that. That fountain was uh, something I was really proud of. Then over here, another mini fountain for the other side of the spa. And we're going to get into the brown room. This is meant for a single person. Lower cost too. But yeah, and over here is the white room. Even lower cost, but again for a, a single person. Another massage treatment room. And moving on. I have a thing about closing all the doors. It just feels more complete to me. You'll have to excuse me for doing that. Over here is the is a waiting room slash quiet room. Just for people to sit down, read something, maybe have a drink or something, or to zone out. All that good stuff, you know? Getting more view of the spa here. And you can see to the left, there's a couple of uh, llamas, I think. They're sitting there in the... Uh, I don't know, bobbing up and down in the ocean for some reason. Like a carousel, it's kind of weird. I don't know what they're doing there. But anyway, these are the beach houses. They have TV inside these in particular. Yes, and cable. They're designed for, uh, well, a wealthier class of people. People with money. They could stay in these private beach houses. Bathroom and shower. Connected right to the bedroom there with an ocean view right from your bedroom. There's two of them. One on the other side also. We'll get there in just a moment. I have to do this. It's, I don't know, just, I just do. So here we go. Walking around to the other side. Making sure the windows too are not facing uh, each other, you know, the other building because it's just creepy to look in on your neighbors like that. Nobody wants that. So yeah, it's more or less designed the same way. But again, you're getting an ocean view, so hey, pay a little extra for it, why not? And there's that shower and bathroom on this side as well. I had a lot of fun putting all this together, by the way. It was just, uh, Something I was contemplating one day, I was like, I bet I could do this in Minecraft. And I'm probably going to work on another one too. In fact, I already am. So yeah, I'll close this up. We'll go down this walkway. Now this is a, like a, a back entrance, if you will, or a back walkway. Where we're going to get to uh, some of the amenities of the resort. You see there's a, there's a garden section right there to the left, or right in front of us now. And I was really impressed. I'm not a huge Minecraft player, but I kind of got into this whole, well, I got the bug, you know? So the, these colors, I was really impressed with how they turned out. Something I'd certainly sit and chill in if I wanted to enjoy nature. And then a pool. This is obviously the one designed for the big kids, the adults, it's deeper. On the other side, we got a Got a kiddie pool. Little kids can splash around in. Open seating all around the pools for anybody who needs to just sit and chill. Then we got this walkway that I designed to get to, that's connected to the pools. Heads right to the living quarters. On this side, it's all the uh, single spaces or, or couples. Again, shower slash bath, the restroom itself. You have to really uh, improvise to make your makeshift items. 
you know, I, I think I used a composter for a toilet, and it was a cauldron for a for a sink. And on the other side here, this is the uh, the other single or, or couple's bedroom. Complete also with a bathroom that is connected to its shower or bath. I tried to replicate tinted windows or, you know, more ones that are more opaque so people can't just view inside there. I wish there was the option to have curtains in this game, but I don't, I didn't see this available of any kind, so did what I could. These are the family rooms, bathroom and shower right across from each other. And in, in the family rooms, there's two double beds available. Close it all up. We'll move on to the other room, the other uh, family room. Might be slightly bigger, actually. I'm not sure. I was looking at the spacing earlier. I think I may have made this one a little slightly bigger. So yeah, there's the restroom. On the other side would be the uh, shower slash bath. I'll show you that here. It's all bamboo flooring. In case you're wondering what those planks were, or those blocks. Close that up, and we'll go down the uh, this side corridor here that I made that again connects everything all together. This side corridor is going to lead us to the restaurant slash cafe, which is also right across the way from the, uh, the spa. The restaurant is right behind that red door. Right there, there we go. So yeah, let's take a look. This is the indoor seating area, tables and chairs all set up. And I also put in a bar, ocean view, florals. Yeah, I thought the bar idea was kind of neat. Also outdoor seating for when the weather's nice, you know. Close that up. And I'm also gonna show you guys the uh, kitchen that I set up too, which I thought was a really cool idea. I'm really proud of this, by the way, that, that brick oven, a wood fire grill, I thought it was really cool. And then we have like a delivery area right here where people can just go to this walk-in fridge and freezer. Gotta make sure you're well supplied for your resort restaurant, whatever you may be serving that morning, afternoon, evening. I did one of those multi-course meals, by the way. I went to a resort recently where the chef takes over the evening for you. The multi-course dinner, it was delicious. Six meal, or six courses in one meal. We had tuna, there was a pasta dish, prime rib, salmon, steak, the desserts, or, oh man. It was so good. If you got a chance to go and do that, please do so. And we got some bird's eye views of what the whole place looks like, the complex. Let you guys see all that. I really had a lot of fun doing all this. And like I said earlier, I'm, I'm working on another one. I'm gonna put together another design, another, another resort, another spa, and I'm gonna try and make it bigger too, just see where I can go. This one had so many trees on it that was just getting very annoying to keep clearing out trees all the time. But in this, this next uh, terrain that I was given, not as many trees, so hopefully uh, I won't get as impatient. But yeah, I had a lot of fun with it, and I hope it's gonna inspire some of you. But if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe. It really means a lot to me. I put in a lot of work to all this stuff. Thank you, thank you so much for watching. Hit that thumbs up, click subscribe, and until the next video, take care guys. Thank you.